Hey everybody, it's Mark Yeager, Redland Cotton and Redland Farms. Uh, just doing the first of several series of videos uh, in the cotton field to try to explain to everybody how we grow our cotton. Now it's June, it's uh, July the 1st, and we've been through quite a bunch of dry weather, but we've had some rain lately, so we're lucky as you can see, the cotton is up to right here. Most of it is, uh, it's pre-bloom, but it's getting closer. And we, you know, what we talked about, I think the last videos that you saw, we were no-tilling, we, but we got a lot of videos of our planter running. And you can see the corn stubble in the ground. Now this field here, of course it needs spraying again, it's a, in which it won't be any problem, but we had corn here last year. You can see the corn fodder from last year, cobs, and stalks that are shredded up and decaying and fortifying the soil basically with food for the, the underground uh, flora that we're, uh, we have living underneath, worms and microscopic organisms of every kind, trying to make our soil healthy by rotation and cover crop. This field here was not cover crop, but it was rotated with corn. And uh, it serves to several purposes. It, uh, it serves to enrich the soil, and plus it covers the top up in uh, the soil from erosion and wind and, and torrential rains that we get around here in the winter. Uh, as far as the cotton goes, uh, this, is, uh, this is DPL 1522, and it's, it's fruiting really good. As you can see, it's full of squares. Now, if you don't know what a square is, that's a square right there. Can you get a close-up of that? First, you get, these are the little buds that come out on cotton plants first. Uh, and it takes 20-something uh, days normally for a square to bloom. I don't see any blooms in this field particularly, but all these squares are potential open bowls of cotton someday. This cotton looks really good, and healthy, and it's uh, what we'd call squaring real nicely coming on. It should bloom next week to some degree. It should start to bloom, and then it'll bloom until, you know, if it gets good weather, it'll bloom until late August and early September. So anyway, this is the first of our series of videos and uh, of the the cotton we're growing and in a field, this field we call it McKay. We've been working it a lot of years. It's a good field. Uh, last crop we had here made over, well over two bales per acre, and that was the year before last year, which is in a, a year to year rotation of corn and cotton. So this is where our linens are gonna come from, from fields like this that we're gonna take care of best we can and and uh, hopefully come with a good outcome this fall. Until the next time, thank you very much.